Last episode, we saw Kenpachi's, is it his Shikai? And all it did was turn his sword into a bigger sword. But he, <laughs> he fucking, he, he was able to cut dimensions. He said there's nothing he can't cut. I guess we'll find out if that's actually true, like later. I wonder if they'll make him fight Yuha and then get smoked. I'll be mad as shit. I mean, he fought the Yuha clone last season and he got smoked, but now he is a lot stronger, mm. supposedly. So mm -hmm. maybe he has a chance, but uh, yeah, I guess we'll see. Uh, it was a cool fight last episode. Again, like I said, they had a lot of fun with Grimmy's powers and the water and mm -hmm. yeah, black holes. And there was a lot of uh, interesting visuals to look at. So it was cool to see that come to life and they did a good job so excited to see what happens in this episode yeah yeah facts i'm so fucking ready it'd be nice if ichigo shows up this episode that'd be really fucking nice <laughs> i've only been saying it every episode <laughs> oh fyi fuck i didn't even say anything uh i tore my hamstring so he's in a bit of pain right now so i'll do a bit more of the talking mm. uh, we were having a foot race i actually visited america and he tripped over my dick so Oh, you know, it's just one of those things that happens. And, you know, it's just my bad. I should have, you know, had that situation under control. But, uh, yeah, he's in a bit of a recovery situation now. So, yeah, yeah. Uh, send hearts and thoughts to our boy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>「ああ、what the fuck?」oh oh! Holy shit. Oh, yeah, that's what I see. Oh my god, they just smoking everybody. Yeah, y'all are super dead. Oh, he's dead as fuck. You turn into zombies? Oh my god. Oh shit. <laughs> oh my god. Everybody's just dying. I mean, cool pals, but you're smoking scrubs. I'm not impressed. <laughs> oh yeah. Her name is fucking Catnip. Oh fuck. <laughs> That's Kenpachi, dog. Of course he's a monster. Yo, you killed his whole squad. Damn, that was good. Yeah. I can't even imagine that. Like, to, to know Kenpachi and then to feel his spiritual pressure fucking falling. <gasps> Is it time? Yes. Fucking final. Mm. What is this music? <laughs> I dig it. Oh, oh shit, oh, wow, it's a yeah. remix. <laughs> Damn, look at his light. Something's coming. It's me. It's me. <laughs> I was going to say the same shit. Damn. Yeah, he don't give a fuck. Oh, whoa. <laughs> he did a quick um, fart. Nice. <laughs> Oh! Mm. <laughs> oh, <open> this! <laughs> <laughs> Damn! Oh, don't worry, he looks better. <laughs> yeah, he looks pretty cool. Look at him smiling Damn. at them. That's awesome. <laughs> she just shit out of fucking. <laughs> oh, they all have little heart pouches for their bows. That's cool. This nigga Aizen just in the corner. I know people gonna be mad at me that I keep because I keep calling him Aizen, but that nigga is definitely Aizen's twin brother. I can't remember who said it. His handsome Squidward Aizen. <laughs> I think that was you. <laughs> it wasn't me. <laughs> Might have been someone else who I watched. Hmm. What the? F <laughs> I just fucking whispered that shit. Wow. <laughs> he looks so clean with the two swords now. Mm -hmm. Holy slave. <laughs> <laughs> the best. <laughs> Definitely did not want to do it. 
Tanga. Okay. <laughs> Dumbbell <laughs> baton. <laughs> wow. Fork. <laughs> Damn. Ooh, shit. These are really cool fellas. Mm hmm. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, I take it back. <laughs> Friendly fire. Oh! Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, I guess it doesn't really matter. Yeah. I thought she was dead for sure. Damn. Are you definitely missing? Oh! Ooh. Oh shit! It was like I don't want to kill you. <laughs> I thought she was gonna be dust for the cleaning lady that comes on Monday. Oh shit! Calm down, bitch. You need to kill them, bro. Oh. Uh, really? <laughs> <laughs> what, what an interesting logic. I like it. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. Mm. Damn, he about to get jumped. <laughs> Fuck. You better turn on the heat. Stop being nice. What? Maybe what? he opened like a path when he was coming down or something. Mm. <clears throat> right, they did briefly mention this that you needed a way to pass through and get into the palace or whatever, so it makes sense that he needed something to get out and come back down. Mm -hmm. 6,000 seconds. Someone do the math. <laughs> <laughs> I'm definitely not going to do it. 100 minutes. I'm so fucking stupid. Holy shit. That was like the easiest. <sighs> I'm not even going to bother. <laughs> oh shit, it's Aizen. Mm. Bring him out. They only showed me his forehead. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Oh. oh. <laughs> I like her voice. Word. Come on, Ichigo, man. Just fucking smoke them. Oh, shit, Renji. Oh, nice. Another Renji dub? His sword has never looked cooler. That was the best animated his sword has ever been. Mm -hmm. Even his hairstyle. I'm about, to, I'm about to make the same hairstyle. Weak ass arrow. Who else but Udiu's bitch ass? Shut up, you can't stop him. And he's even voiced by Sasuke, isn't he? <laughs> Is he? Naruto and Sasuke. <laughs> Ichigo, you came all the way down here to get fucking sh oh, saved by Chad? Whoa. Oh. Look at God. My face already healed from your bitch ass attack. Damn, there really wasn't nothing I else? I mean, I, <laughs> I was very entertained by that whole episode. I feel like that episode was exactly what I wanted after how many episodes of just sort of 1v1s. Mm. That really felt like the story progressed. So we got past the, you know, this person versus this person. And we started moving the story and the plot forward a little bit. We got to see a lot of characters. Um, yeah, I really like this episode. This is probably the best one in a while for me, just in terms of variety. There was so much stuff that happened, and yeah, I loved it. So I will say I haven't read Thousand Year Blood War. I haven't seen anything on it, right? Mm. So I will say I know Ishida isn't fully on Yuhabaha's side. I know he has something up his sleeve, but he's still a fucking bitch. <laughs> so... <laughs> Little punk ass arrows. Them shit is the weakest. He had the weakest attack of all the Quincy since this shit started. I mean, if he's not on Yuha's side, then why would he try to attack Ichigo? Well, be, any he's, kind of because he's strength. standing next to Yuha. <laughs> you gotta make it believable. <laughs> he gave him a little scratch, and we healed from it instantly. Fuck Udi. 
But I know, I know, <laughs> I know he's not on their side. I know he's on our side. I'm not, I'm not stupid. Now, if they kill him, like if they smoke him by this time this shit is over, damn. <laughs> I'd really feel a way like, oh shit, he actually was on their side. But I know he's not on their side because anime yep. and the power of friendship. You don't just fuck up the power of friendship. Even if it takes you <laughs> two series, you know what I mean, to become or to, you know, to accept it, you know, like Naruto, Naruto Shippuden, and then Boruto, like Sasuke's best friends with Naruto. I mean, even if it takes yep. you two fucking full length feature shows and 30 movies, the power of friendship in anime is unbeatable. The power of friendship yeah. is definitely going to work here. <laughs> and it's shown in, fuck out of here. He's definitely not on their side. You haven't seen uh, Parasite. I have seen Parasite. Okay. So the hunger, um, Stern wrote mm -hmm. that feels like a direct reference to Parasite. Because Parasite, um, I'm pretty sure Parasite came out in like the 70s, maybe. The, the manga, not that anime. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So that feels really much like a Migi yeah. Parasite. It did. Um, yeah. <laughs> I was about to be like, damn, that should look good for something that came out in the 70s. <laughs> what the fuck were the animators eating back then? So I don't know if that was a reference, but if it is, it's cool. And they all had really different powers. We had lightning. Mm -hmm. We had hunger. We had zombie. And then I think the pink girl was just power. Mm -hmm. With the batons. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the yeah. shake weights, whatever. Dumb yeah, dumbbell batons. <laughs> They're definitely yeah. shake weights. She, she would jerk the yeah. shit off out of you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, it was it was it was it was a dope episode. Uh, Kenpachi getting smoked was pretty sad, but um, at least he didn't die. His whole squad died though, which is crazy. And you know he's not a protagonist because if he was the protagonist, he'd have got a power up. But he ain't get a power <clears> up, so that's how we know he's not yeah, the protagonist. Yeah, I was kind of surprised at how I wouldn't say easily because he just had a tough fight, but. It did seem like he went down quite easily, uh, considering who he is, mm -hmm. right? But it's understandable because he was fighting the self-proclaimed strongest yeah. Stern Ritter or whatever. So you know, it's cool. He won, and then he had to fight four other people after. So you know, understandable. They did that for like narrative sake. So when Ichigo shows up, it's like, oh shit, he's actually mad strong because they beat Kenpachi. Yeah, true. Um, and then talking about Ichigo, he showed us, I think that's the first time we've ever seen it, Getsuga Jujisho, which is mm -hmm. uh, a cross mm -hmm. of two Getsugas at the same time or something. So mm -hmm. that looked amazing. And I thought Lightning Girl was going to get exploded, but she yeah. lost an arm. So I think the funniest thing was that Ichigo didn't want to kill her and he was like, get out of the way. And that kind of shows his attitude and that he doesn't really want to kill people and that's kind of why when he saw um yuha going up to the portal he just sort of ignored everyone and they're trying to stop him and i'm sure he could have killed some people but that's just not who he is and he didn't want to so yeah i think that's a flaw ichigo has i don't want to kill nobody when they are literally mm. smoking your friends by the thousands mm. like you know what i mean and they're dying in the most yeah, gruesome true. ways and you're just like no i can't kill nobody like man I'd be slaying everybody and everything. Fuck that. How many people died since they fucking invaded in the first episode? I mean, we saw Zaraki's uh, people just get... The whole squad. Yeah. That was like 50 people just dead while you was on your way. And yeah. you're like, oh, get out of the way. What? No. They need death. Because if you don't kill them, they go. They just want to come back. They lucky. If I was a protagonist in an in a, in a anime, I'd just be cooking everybody. Especially if I went on an OD training arc. Every arc. You know what I mean? I would just be smoking everybody, bro. When I show up with my eyes closed, that's how you know I'm super strong. And then I just start fucking everybody. That's what I would do. That's why you like Death Note. But spoilers, at the end of Death Note. Uh, my favorite character is Ryuk. So what happened to him? True. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But anyway, y'all let us know what you guys think in the comments. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the bell. See you don't miss out on any of these videos. Check out the Patreon and social media. And we'll see you in the next one.